The Thousand Year Door. Pit of a Hundred Trials. Oh boy, Pit of a Hundred. I am, I am both not and am looking forward to doing that particular trial. That'll be a fun stream to do when all is said and done. I present to you, O oh Thousand Year Door, the power of the Basil Star. I got it from a ghost in a ship, in a cave, on an island, surrounded by water and fire and death. But we have it. And it is ours. Imbue my map with the power of basil. Just get that salt shaker full of basil, pour it on the map, and then it'll be fantastic. Oh my gosh, what color is this one? Purple? Oh, it's it's the the reddish orange one. Okay, this one is um um paprika. Did have we done paprika? I don't think we've done paprika. It can be the paprika star. Cuz the first one was ginger and then the green one was oregano. Ginger, oregano, Basil, paprika. I forget the others. I'll have to look. Review the footage. Oh, yeah. We'll go back to the professor. I'm sure we'll, we'll find more spice stars. We'll make this ultimate salad. Do, 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 do. Great news, my friends. The next crystal star is in Poshley Heights. Wait a tick. I've heard tell that only the rich and famous call that place home. Yes, yes. I'm fairly certain that there's also a shrine to the stars called Poshley Sanctum. No fearsome monsters or dangerous dungeons either. It's purely a tourist attraction. I hope you know that now that you've said that, Professor, that there is going to be nothing but fearsome monsters, dangerous dungeons, and it won't be anything ex It won't be a tourist attraction, is my point. Her rump sounds positively scintillating, dear boy. Point is there. That's the best part. You ride the most famous train of all, the Excess Express. Yes, after a luxurious steam excursion, excursion, the next crystal star will be yours. I keep telling you, Professor, spice stars, not the crystal stars. Uh, excuse me, dear, my dear boy. Getting those crystal... I have to, I have to get the voice down. Getting those crystal stars has been backbreaking work, but this time will be a cinch. Pardon me. <laughs> the Professor Goomba and the Bobbery voice are exactly the same. I am not a voice actor. Pardon me for... Pardon... <laughs> I, just, I can't... You know my voice is giving out when I can no longer do the voices. Pardon me for saying so. Mustn't you have wealth or fame to ride that train? Hmm, that may be true. Perhaps you should ask Don Pianta for help with this too. Oh, we get to go say hi to the Don. Oh, uh, no, terribly sorry. Mm, impossible. Can't do it. The man's reprehensible. Well, drat. I suppose there's nothing for it, eh, old boy? If we must, we must. Let's go. Excellent. Then we're set. We may not have much time left, so you must hurry. I'll gather all the information I can. You guys handle things on your end. All right. Well, it's time to upgrade our partners. So we have many options. We can upgrade literally everyone. I think uh, we have we have four choices. We have four choices. We can upgrade four people. I am thinking. I am thinking. I am thinking. Vivian, Bagels, Gumbella, and Bobbery. That's the choice. I think that might be the best for things. So Gumbella, you can get the first one. Wait, I forgot. It gives it gives a a a, a name for the skills. Gumbella's is going to get Rally Wink, which raises Mario's attack. Wait, you can use Rally Wink to up Mario's attack turns by one. Oh, so you get a second attack turn. Mmm, that's interesting. What does Koops get? Shell Slam to attack all grounded enemies. 
Vivian can already do that, but better, so that's out of the question. Flurry can use Dodgy Fog to make the Mario Dodgy. Mm, not liking that. Stampede to attack all ground enemies. I like Stampede as a move, so I'm still going with that. Infatuate to confuse all enemies and hold fast to damage direct attackers. Boost Mario's HP. No, nah, I'm going with the original plan. I like Goombella. Yep. <clears throat> Shazibi! Shazubi! Power up my partners, please. Rotate and imbue them with star power. Ah, uh, liquids. They're the best. <clears throat> yes, power up more, please. I want... Wow, 30 HP. That's double my own. That's insane. Bagels as well. You shall indeed power up the partner. Shazubi! Shazubi! Now that you have the red crystal bar ball, my red Yoshi will be able to synergize perfectly. Do, 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 do. Care to power up more? Yes. Power it up by the power of Camo Cat, who has been here the entire time. Literally, both of you guys have been here the entire time, and I am immensely grateful. Thank you so much for tuning in for so long. Vivian. I absolutely want Vivian here. I shall power up the partner. Vivian, the absolute goat, getting that Shazibi and that Shazubi slammed into her with the power of a neutron star. Insane. More power. Now she can confuse everyone. Yes, even more. Power up Bobbery. Shazibi, Shazubi, and the newest form of power up, Shaboopy. That will grant you unlimited power. Oh, I like his pose. He's just, he's just raising his head. You may go. Oh, this is fantastic. All right, let's go talk to Bon... Bon... Bon Dianta. No, Don Pianta. The great Gonzalez makes his return. For Don Pianta, I need your help. I need train tickets this time. Oh, wait, don't we... I think we might have to go back to uh, Keel Hall Key to talk to his daughter again. I think there might be a side quest to get that stupid train ticket. But, like I said... We're going until we start chapter five, or chapter six. I definitely want, I want to end the stream on a high note and we can end it on the highest of notes with chapter six. Don, Don, D Don, no, he's dying. Oh, Francesca. Oh, poor boss. The big man's been sick with loneliness ever since his daughter skedaddled. Our underboss Frankie is gone. The boss is in shambles. What's a syndicate to do? That scruffy gang of punk thieves is stealing jobs from us left, right, and center. But hey, enough about us and our stupid problems, huh? What can we do for yous? I need a train ticket. Trick tickets for the ritziest train around? For the XS Express? Whoa. You want tickets for that rolling wingding? Caster? No. Ain't nothing we can do about that. Yeah. Us giving out the tickets? That's rich. You gotta talk to the boss for that. Francesca. I just can't stand seeing the boss like this. If we just knew where those newlyweds, newlyweds were, we could take the boss to see him. You mean those Piantos, Frankie and Francesca? Oh, that's that's the dude. They were on Keel Hall Key. Who's on the what now? What did you just say? Repeat that. You know where the young Miss Pianta's at? Really? No lie? I swear to you, if you lie, and I'll turn you into confetti, so help me God. Well, if that's where she is, why don't you bring her back here? You literally just said you'd bring the boss out. Why do I have to go? We'd go ourselves, but we can't leave the boss unprotected, you get me? Yeah, you bring us young Miss Francesca. And we'll do what we can to get you your train tickets. Yeah, sure. 
that better. I knew once you understood our predicament, you couldn't refuse. Don't screw this up. Right, back to Keelhaw Key. And we don't even have the, the warp, but honestly, it's fast. It's pretty fast to do it anyway. Long squid. Long squid. Don't you just love long squid? Let's check our um, lottery numbers. Ours is 6276. And the numbers of today are... 2712. Well, that's unfortunate. Can I have a mushroom consolation prize? Um, was that the same as always? Oh, that might not change. Hmm, interesting. Maybe I can <laughs> waggle my fingers and have some RNG magic. Right, the book, the book, the book. We can go to Keelhaw Key after we get the book. I want to hear more of Luigi's story. Super Luigi 2. Big investment, but yeah, I do want it. All right. I I desire I greatly desire it. Super Luigi 2. Super Luigi, Volume 2, Allies in Adventure. It's a little warm, Luigi muttered, the sweat dripping from his brow as he followed the compass up Rumblevump's volcano's side. Must find the secret grotto. While Luigi had guts to spare, he did need a guide, and he found one in Bluey, a blooper he met in town. Brave Bluey joined Luigi and instantly proved to be invaluable. With, Lu with his aid, Luigi bested a savage statue that protected the treasure. That treasure was none other than a piece of the marvelous compass, a piece that pointed west towards Plump Belly Village. The second Luigi saw Plump Belly Village, he knew something was amiss. All was woe, and Luigi soon learned the reason why from the local mayor. The town was at the mercy of a sinister serpent who demanded sacrificial lasses. Burning with indignation, Luigi formed a team of liberators. A fierce bomb -om warrior named Jerry joined his crew and joins chose, not surprisingly, to stick with Luigi for the duration of his quest for Eclair. Fortified by his allies, Luigi strode onto the lair of the beast, a foul, two-headed snake. No time to think, Luigi sprang forth. Twin heads snapped at his heels, fangs dripping venom. Then, as one mouth <laughs> then as one mouth gaped wide to swallow Luigi, the other crept behind. Our hero sensed the treachery and fainted. Before leaping, the heads collided and the beast ate itself. The prize? A compass piece. The villagers begged their savior to stay with them, but a grim-faced Luigi pressed bravely onward. To be continued in next week's volume of Super Luigi. Oh my gosh, I was on the edge of my seat. I love that. Mario may have been asleep, but I'm sure Bagels loved that story. I'm glad we read it. Unfortunately, we have no money. <laughs> Between streams, I'm just going to get a gamble. I'm, ju I'm just going to gamble all of the money. And then I will strike it rich. Cortez, my man, amigo. I am going to the key. He just, sh he just shrank us straight into the, the deck of the boat. Off to the ocean blue. Frankie, Francesca, the boss is sick. I need you guys to get back. Many days and many nights passed on their long voyage, but finally, they have returned to Keelhaw Key. Frankie, Francesca, the boss, he's sick. He needs to see you guys again. Toad, you should really clean up. The peon- The piñatas? I think they're off in the jungle. Man, am I jealous. Don't- 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 Don't bring that up. You guys really need to, like, clean up. You're, like, on- Surrounded by water. Surely you can, like, take a shower somewhere. Or a bath, at the very least. Excuse 
Excuse me. Ah. Where are they? Frankie! Oh, hey, it's Mario. How you been, dear pal? We do something for you? What? The boss is sick. Oh, poor daddy. Oh, no. And at a time like this. You see, I... I dropped the wedding ring Frankie gave me around here. I can't possibly leave until I find it. Otherwise, something may eat it. It must be somewhere between here and that skull rock. Listen for a second, my fuzzy little coconut. Shouldn't we forget about that ring now and check on the boss? How could you say that, Frankie? That ring was the symbol of our love. We have to find it. We have to. Or maybe you just don't love me anymore. Is that it? Of course I love you, my little bacon burger. None of your sweet talk now, mister. You're gonna have to say you love me a hundred times. A hundred times? If you love me, you have to say it, Frankie. Aw, oh, come on now, babe. Of course I love you, my little short stack. Now please, let's go. No, you have to say it 99 more times, Frankie. Aw, oh, fine, you crazy dame. I love you. 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 Ten times. I love you. 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 I love you and you. I love 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 Y O U. That spells you. I love 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 you. Nice. I love you. 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 I said it. Oh my gosh, my tongue. I I need another drink. Uh, I wasn't prepared for that. Aw, oh, Frankie, baby, you're such a silly billy. <laughs> now, my little cream puff, let's find that ring right away. What do you say? Wow, you think these guys are going to be all right looking for that thing on their own? Listen, Mario, we'd better play it safe and help them, don't you think? Yeah, we might, we might as well. Man, now the word love doesn't sound like an actual word. Is it in this bush? No. That's a mini Mr. Mini. No, leave me alone. I hope I never have to do that again. That was not something I expected to do today. That'll be a fun thing to edit in the, in the YouTube video. I wonder what future me will do for that. I'll leave it for him. It's in one of these bushes. I think. We will see, I suppose. Nope. Nope. Oh, I should probably pick up a coconut at one of these points. I probably need that for some recipes. Oh, there it is. It's not even in a bush. I got the wedding ring. A pricey ring, the symbol of Frankie and Francesca's love. Oh, now we can go back, finally. Get this out of the way. Frankie, Francesca, I got the symbol of your love. Here you go. Oh, hey, that's it. That's it. That's the, the ring. That's the ring. You found it, pal. Frankie, now we can go home to dad. 
We sure can, my little cheese and cracker. Let's go. Well, so anyway, we'll be down at the dock. Please hurry back. Finally, we can continue on with our adventure. We get, we gotta get back to the boss. So the boss can give us train tickets so we can get on a train and then relax on a train. We were on a boat this chapter. We're on a train next chapter. Oh, we're, and we were on a... Bl of all the vehicles that Mario's been on, we've been on boat. We're going to be on train. We've taken a blimp. We've done it all. Okay, Mario. I think we're ready, pal. Yeah, we're ready to go back to Rogueport. Oh, daddy, please hang on until we get there. Back to Rogueport, my friend. Bueno, cast off me, amigos. To Rogueport. And there's still a hole in the wall. You can tell by the white torn paper on the side of the cliff. Can we skip this, please, Cortez? Oh, we can. That's fantastic. Back in Rogueport. We have to go see Daddy immediately. You got it, Francesca. And that's our cue as well. Can we catch up with them? Oh, they actually are still running. That's that's hilarious. Yoshi, quickly, quickly, catch up with them. How do pinatas that are so fat get there so quickly? Not that I would disparage, dis, disparage piantas for their natural bulk. One might say that they're insulated and make great pillows, as I'm sure... Frankie's found out. <laughs> no. Not doing that. Can I buy a life shroom here? Oh my gosh, I can. I need another one of these. Just in case. Thank you, Ms. Boo. I really liked it. Boss, I did it. Daddy, daddy, daddy. Wake up, open your eyes. Boss. Oh no, he's dead. Francesca. Dad. Boss. Oh, my little Francesca, you came back for me. And you too, Frankie. Of course we did, Dad. As soon as as soon as we heard you were ill, we dropped everything and rushed back. Francesca, Frankie, I was wrong. I was a stubborn old man, forgive me. I know I may regret saying this, but I want the two of yous to stay here with me. I can't bear to be away from you two crazy kids. I'm an old man now, I need peace. I guess the time's come for me to stop being so selfish, causing everyone trouble. She refused to leave without that ring. She she absolutely refused to come back to you, old man, unless she had this <laughs> this diamond ring. Looks like even Dawn beyond the, the dawn of untimely death can't escape the old age. The time has come. Everyone, I'm gonna retire. Whoa, boss. No. No, it's time. I mean it. And I want you to be my successor, Frankie. What do you say, Frankie? As of today... You are the new head of the Pianta Syndicate. You're the new head of the Pia <laughs> the Pinata Syndicate. You may now mass produce the Pinatas. What? But, but boss, you still got it in you. You're a spring chicken. You don't gotta do this. And I mean, me, boss? I mean, you did technically marry my daughter. You're my son-in-law, Frankie. It's literally how this thing works. It's a familial thing. I've been thinking about this for a long time now. You'll do just fine, kid. I got a feeling about you. A good one. I want you to take care of Francesca and the rest of the syndicate. The way I did. Boss! You, Mario. It looks like you've done yet another for me. favor for me, kid. Yeah. Uh, about that, boss. Oh, this is gonna be just beautiful. I know it. What did you guys do? Well, uh, we kind of promised him something, boss. We told him we'd get him a ticket for the XS Express if he bought if he brought back your daughter. 
Whoa, is that all? You had me worried for a second. Come on over here, Mario. How many you want? One, two, ten, help yourself. Train tickets. A ticket for the ritzy train to Poshley Heights. I need like eight tickets, boss. I, I want for all my parties. Whoa, yow. You come back anytime you like. How about that? Well, now that I've retired, I'm gonna get out of here. Dad! Boss! You're the boss now, Frankie. You got that? You, the boss. You the boss, Frankie. You do good now, you hear? And he walked off into the sunset to never be seen again. Frankie, we've got a lot of work to do, and don't worry, I'll keep you in line. Sweet Bean, come on. Knock it off with the pet name nonsense, will you? Call me Francesca. Huh? F -f 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 Francesca? Yes, or Miss Boss. <laughs> On the boss, uh, er, I mean, boss, you got our loyalty. We'll be by your side whenever you need us, boss. Thank you so much, Mario, for everything. You're welcome here anytime. You're like a brother to me. You ain't bad, kiddo. Yeah, you ever think about joining up with the syndicate? It's the life, kid. Aw, oh, that's, that's adorable. Yoshi, get off the bed. Bagels, please. If there's anything ever the, the, the pinata syndicate can do for you, just say the word. All right, we have our train ticket. That means we can go onto the train and start the lovely chapter six. So, once we start chapter six, oh, apparently there's still more to do. Yes, 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 we can go to Poshley Heights, yes. That sixth crystal star, spice star, bagels. It's as good as ours. Right, spice stars. Got it. I heard that, my uglies. So the sixth crystal star is in Poshley Heights, is it? That's a rather nice piece of information. Thanks ever so. I have no idea what that was. That voice was. Hey, you're that Beldam. You're right, I evolve, I evolve into a Metagross eventually. Normally, I wouldn't be where I... F Normally, this would be where I finally deal with you and that homely traitor, Vivian. Oh, trust me, Beldum, trust me. Vivian could kick your sorry purple ass. Six ways from Sunday. Something tells me that trying that alone might be unwise. So you live for now. Instead, I'll just beat you to that poshly heights and get that crystal star before you do. <laughs> Do you honestly think you can outrun a train, Beldum? Whoa, that sounded bad. We gotta get to Poshley Heights before that witch. Well, let's make tracks for Rogueport Station. Well, you you insisted, so I will ride you straight to, to the train. One more save. Oh, we get oh, we get to end we get to end with an email. Oh, that's fantastic! <laughs> and the universe is conspiring against us. Mail from a random boo. Are you Mario? Did this email? Did you get this email? Look, technology freaks me out. So if you're not Mario, please destroy this email, okay? But if you are, thanks for saving thanks for saving my captured friends. I figured I'd share a hot tip with you as thanks. So here it is. There's still lots of treasures in Creepy Steeple. Of course, knowing you, you've already probably found it all. Ugh, I'm so useless. Well, enjoy your not-so-useless adventure. The Creepy Steeple Boo. Oh, wow, thank you. I appreciate the thought, Creepy Steeple Boo. But yeah, we've already found that book. Are you the one that they gang-tackled for looking at the, at the train? All I ever think about is how this train cuts through the wind as fast as it races across plains. Like a torpedo on Earth, slicing through the relentless winds. Doesn't it just fire you up inside? I don't have the money yet, but my dream is to one day ride this train. I have a ticket. I am going to get on the train. This train is bound for luxurious Poshley Heights. Will you be boarding today? Yes, I will. Wonderful. If you don't mind, please allow me to check your ticket. Ah, uh, here it is. I've got it from a crime boss. Watch your step, please. All aboard! That was terrible. That was a terrible, terrible toy voice. I'm never doing that again. 
we have boarded the train. All aboard for chapter six. Oh, this is going to be fun. One of my favorite chapters. This is going to be, oh, I cannot wait. I can't, I literally can't wait for next week so I can play this some more. I might have to do a, a stream earlier in the week. Maybe on Thursday next week, next Thursday. Either way, we are here to begin chapter six. Oh my gosh, three days of excess. Oh, this is going, <laughs> this is going to be so much fun. Chapter six. Let's get, I, I'll give you guys a little, a tiny taste. Mario's room. Oh yeah, the XS Express. This is so deluxe, man. The three days to Poshley Heights are gonna be over like that. Huh? Hey, you see that? Something's on the floor. When did that get there? Don't go to Poshley Heights. Get off the train now or a sticky, yummy doom awaits it. Whoa, what a freaky threat. You don't think this could be Beldum's worth, do you? Whoever the psycho is, you gotta figure they're on this train, right? We gotta get this nut before anything bad goes down on this train. Well, 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 well. It seems like there's a mystery afoot. And we are almost certainly going to be the ones to solve this mystery.